Two roller bearings from different manufacturers are being considered for a certain application. The first bearing has a catalog rating of 2 kN based on a catalog rating system of 3000 hours at 500 revolutions per minute. The bearings from the second manufacturer have a catalog rating of 6 kN based on a catalog that rates its bearings at 1 million cycles. For an application of 20,000 hours at 240 revolutions per minute, with an expected reliability of 95%, and knowing that the Weibull parameters for each manufacturer are not the same, which one of the bearings will carry a larger load? Use an application factor of 1.2. This is the first example for the bearings reliability main video, link below. During that video, we developed an expression to calculate the load rating as a function of the parameters of a manufacturer, the desired reliability, and the life and load of our application. In this case, we have the load for which the bearings have been rated, and we want to find the load that the bearings would be able to carry for our specific application. The reliability and A value will not change. And to calculate the dimensionless multiple of rating life XD, we'll need the life for our design or application and the rated life, both in number of cycles. The life for our application is 288 million cycles, the rated life for manufacturer 1 is 90 million cycles, and the life for the bearings of manufacturer 2 is given as 1 million cycles. Therefore, the dimensionless multiple of rating life XD is 3.2 for manufacturer 1 and 288 for manufacturer 2. With the rated load of 2 kN for manufacturer 1, we find that we can subject that bearing to a load of 1.01 kN for 20,000 hours at 240 revolutions per minute. With the rated load of 6 kN for manufacturer 2, we find that that bearing can be subjected to a force of 0.79 kN for the same 20,000 hours at 240 revolutions per minute application. So to answer the question, which bearing manufacturer will carry a larger load for our specific application, the answer would be manufacturer 1. For one more example on bearings reliability, make sure to check out the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.